Well, look, why don't you just have somebody search the lounge? He's got to be somewhere. I just didn't... Oh, I've been calling around all over town. I can't find him. It's... Oh, Jimmy, finally. I was afraid I was going to find you in a cheap hotel with some sleazy hooker and... Close. I found them in a sleazy bar with the cheap hooker. Jeez, who are you? Henry, this is Rick. He's going to help me find my daughter. Come on, Jimmy. Hot. We got to get you sobered up in time for your big meetings this morning with the Right to Life folks in the NRA. I love basketball. The NRA, not the NBA. <laughs> right, I knew that. Uh, maybe I should light a cigarette. We're meeting with the tobacco industry people today. That's tomorrow. Drink up today, smoke up tomorrow. Uh, what line of work you folks in, anyway? Uh, CD merchandising. Uh, we're on almost the majority of cable television networks in the South and the Midwest. Almost as many as the Playboy Channel. Looking to expand into the East. So anyway, you really think you can help Jimmy here find his runaway daughter, even though she doesn't want to be found? There's a lot of ways to find people. Bank accounts, credit cards, uh, telephone bills, passport records. You give me your last known address, I'll find her. If you tell me why first. Your uh, runaway is well past legal age. That she is. Jimmy here did everything for her. Sent her to the best private schools, prestigious colleges, medical school in Grenada. Gave her money whenever she needed it. And this is how she repaid him. Wow. Where do you see the one of her in the leather little bull peep outfit? Where's that? Hey, that's my daughter you're looking at. My favorite one is the one with the two girls, the three guys, and the ferret. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. Shocking. Bad framing. We can't let you see the pictures. They change our rate. Anyway, we got the first series a few months ago with instructions to put 10 rolls of 10 $100 bills in a manila envelope and send it to a post office box in Grenada. Well, we figured it was probably his daughter pulling a fast one, so we sent the money. And then they sent you another uh, package of photos. Right. This time they wanted 15000 the same way to a post office box in St. Martin, or they'd post the photos on the Internet. And you sent that, and then you got another photo series. For $20,000 to a post office box in St. Lucia. The last one we got was for $25,000. Well, we feel we've been patient enough, and we put up with just about all we can. And you don't want the uh, photos displayed on the Internet, just in case Jimmy here decides to run for public office. How'd you, how did he know Can't that? Can a man be worried about his daughters getting humiliated? <laughs> By the looks of these, she's not going to be humiliated over anything. And besides, why else would you be meeting with the three most powerful interest groups in America? Look, these groups are looking for an image, and, and, and Jimmy is that image. And look, having a daughter who's a kinky call girl all over the Caribbean is not exactly their idea of family values. Look, needless to say, all of this needs to be uh, kept, you know. Yeah, yeah, I know. You know, Confidential is my middle name. Really? Mine's Joshua. <laughs>